Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about the best free online bibliography and citation tool. We are going to summarize nearly five important tools. So let us see the very first one is bibme.org. So here you can see the interface and this is provided to us by the service called Check Services. So bibme is what the bibliography. Okay. So bibliography and citation tools is most important and required for every researchers and one who is doing the e-learning projects and everything. So it is very, very essential that you should know what are all available there. So the first one is what bibme. So here the one of the uh, best tool that is we call it we can uh, we can consider bibme so here we have four citation styles okay you can see that this is a mla so we have various types of citations one is mla uh, a citation harvard okay harvard and apa and chicago so this we usually used to uh, uh, that is the journal or even the conferences if they are asking for they'll be referring that this is what the citation style they need so in bibme they are they have uh, uh, four type of citations okay that is mla apa curabian and chicago and uh, you can find variety of sources including journal websites and uh, materials online materials and everything and uh, here you can see that here they have also one more tool one more uh, option that is plagiarism checking if you want to check for your plagiarism then you can check that and also the grammar checking so great here you can see that uh, the very first one is create citation so if you want to create a citation you can go ahead here and start working with uh, start uh, getting the citation so previously before knowing all these things you know we used to type everything okay from the paper uh, we will be getting the what to say we'll be getting the first name of the author last name and what is the conference or journal they are going to present and everything but in this case you don't want to do anything simply you can see that these are all the source okay website book journal more so if you click here you can also find it from newspaper uh, film online video great online database advertisement bible blog brochure and everything they have many options over here so let us simply go with the journal Okay, I'm just uh, simply selecting the journal. So you have to select the journal and then simply type the journal name. Uh, if you want, uh, if you want by the um, content, so let, I'm just typing the content. Okay, and if I'm giving the search. So you can see that you have various options that is this data mining process. If you definitely, if you know the name of the paper, for example, in, for example, let us see, I'm just getting a name of the paper. Okay. So let us simply call this as a, um, uh, this is what the paper, which I just wanted to find it. Okay. I'm just copying this and I'm going to paste this here. Okay. Let us see. Okay. So this is what, these are all the various thing. Uh, the systematic lupus arithmetic is manifestation. This is what my paper. So if you want to cite this paper, okay, simply click cite. Okay. Once if you click cite you can get these information see this is what the journal title okay and what is the publication year publication month and article what is the name of the article just click continue and what you will get next see the same process will be for all the citation thing okay citation tool so here you can find the information if you want to add the suffix or prefix whatever you want you can uh, just write it and finally you can if you want any other advanced info you have to give here okay and uh, if you want to just to give complete annotation you can give here complete annotation uh, here if you feel that see this is there by default they are giving APA 7 okay APA 7 uh, style it is loading so this is what the apa 7 style if you want to change it you can change it to any other format like mla 9 mla 8 everything and if you want to know more about the styles okay why they are very specific about the styles please leave your comment i'll be helping you out what is the purpose of the styles and everything yes so if you want to use this you can copy okay just to select this copy the citation or export to your content okay so this exactly you can use it for your purpose 
so the first one is over let us go to the citation mission yes it is also on another see check this uh, the previous one which we see which we saw is what the free one okay next one is what the citation mission so this is also one of the most free available freely available tool which you can use it for and even here they are concentrating on the four major citation that is apa mla and uh, chicago turabian and everything and you can search it from various uh, libraries okay so here you can see that the same thing you can see that create citation and whatever the procedure procedure we have uh, used in the previous one now you can use that uh, the next one is what uh, cite fast okay cite fast is also an another uh, uh, free available uh, tool for citation so you can simply take all your uh, type topic like your journal or book or uh, website uh, that is every the relevant information even title is more than enough you can just take that and use this so in site fast they are using only three styles that is apa mla and chicago okay so here likewise if you want to search for any web page you can search it or if you want to search for the book journal or other so whatever you want you can search that just exit uh, just search for it you will get various options over here select this and here you have the data if you want to edit some data if you want to add something just give that and here you, they have given the citation here as well if you want to save the citation you can save it by logging in create your account and log in keep all your uh, citation that is you keep all your references in one place or else if you want to just copy and paste it ever you are currently immediately then you can copy and paste it so let us see the next one next one is what the scribber okay so here you can see anyhow here also you can see most of the citation tools they are providing various services so here you can see that uh, it is plagiarism checker proofreading and editing apa citation checker so apart from that if you want to uh, generate the citation you can do this everything you have to follow the same one okay if you are just going to cite your website copy the website and paste it there or else give the keyword of the website like data mining or image classification or agriculture so whatever you want you can just give that and get the information and the fourth one is what uh, cite this for me okay so here the same thing here you can just uh, start with the citation what style you want howard apa mla or any other thing which you have but here they are offering various types of citation okay so my favorite is what cite this for me cite so here you can see even ieee iso 1690 you have various options over here okay ame everything you can find it okay so as usual you have to select which citation style you want if you are going with the harvard just give the harvard and then it will ask you for what source you want to cite website or journal or book or uh, more if you click more you will get more and more options inside this for me and then you can select whatever uh, you want okay and then proceed with that find website just, just you can simply give like website and i'm just going to uh, uh, type data mining which is my domain basically data mining data analysis and data science you can see various options so whichever you want you can select if you want multiple thing you have can select that okay and if you want multiple uh, uh, pages web pages to be cited okay you can select that and then finally you can click cite it will generate a site uh, that is a reference and finally this is what the fifth most important one is my bib even here you have various options apa APA, Chicago, Harvard, Harvard Australia, MLA 8 and MLA 9. So this is what the allowed styles here and in the book and journal you can select anything. Okay and more you can select anything and once you give here you can just uh, whatever we have done in the previous for the previous citation tools right you can use that then finally search it. So for all these tools you know all these uh, online tools we have login that is you can create your own account and you can save your uh, 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 that is uh, what are the things which you have uh, generated your uh, citations you have generated the references you have generated you can since just save that and use it for your previous that is future purpose and uh, whatever the citations you are uh, generating just make note of it like uh, for which article you are uh, using that citations and definitely that will be useful for your thesis or uh, synopsis or even if it is a project your college project 
or your MBA project, whatever the uh, course it may be, if you have to refer, refer, reference, you have to give the reference for that. So that will be definitely useful for you. Okay, so from, with this, I'm just, uh, this video is ending. So if you want more information about uh, anything related to research or anything about any specific technology, you can let me know. I'll be definitely helping you out. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.